Hello, Sagittarius, and welcome to your August 2018 Let's Spy on Your Ex video. Okay, this is for Sagittarius X. For August 2018, what is going on? If this resonates with you, Sagittarius, please like, share, and subscribe, and leave me a comment. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button, and if you would like to be notified um, in regards to when I upload or um, go live, make sure you hit the bell next to um, your subscription. If this does not resonate with you, Sagittarius, please check your moon, your rising, and your blue sign, as this will not resonate with every Sagittarius out there. Okay. If you would like a private reading with me, all the information is down below in the description box. This is for Sagittarius. What is going on? with their ex. What is going on with their ex? This is for Sagittarius. What is going on with their ex? Okay. Ooh. So some sort of big dramatic change here at the bottom of the deck. We have Scorpio energy with the death card. And if you hear a little bit of a rumbling in the background, that is my coffee maker. I'm making some coffee because I'm going to be doing these videos for um, a few hours to come and I need my energy. <laughs> At the bottom of the deck, we have this Scorpio energy. Okay. So some big, dramatic, unexpected change happened between the two of you. It was really, um, blindsided right you feel blindsided by this he felt blindsided by this or she um it was just unexpected big time changes here definite uh breakup right um uh, clearing away obstacles okay clearing the path so that possibly there could be a new beginning here you see that sunrise trying to peek out behind those pillars back there Okay, but this was a sudden and dramatic event that had taken place. Okay, a lot of changes, a lot of transformation. <clears throat> Excuse me. The situation is we have the Queen of Pentacles. Now, this is an Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Male or female, um, this is a general reading. They take care of practical everyday wants and needs of everyone around them okay they take care of the mundane they are practical they are down to earth they are earth energy okay they are very focused on their career and finances okay so this person could be very focused on their career right now okay how do they feel they feel um rejected they feel like this is um, a missed opportunity. They feel like you um, are very focused on past events, okay, and closed off, all right? But they feel, you know, like you can't see them. Like this is them and this is you, right? And this is something that they're trying to offer you here, but you just, you can't see it. You're stuck in the past. They feel like, you know, unwanted, unloved, uncared for. And, it, you know, they feel like you're you're focused on all these past hurts and you can't see an opportunity when it's presented to you. And um, they're very hurt by this. They feel rejected. Okay. And keep in mind that these energies can go both ways. Okay. So take it however it resonates with you, Sagittarius. <clears throat> What action will they take? Um, they're not ready to give up yet. Okay, they're going to be sending you some love messages here. Page of Cups, Water Energy, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. 
and they they're going to offer you their cup of love again okay so that is what they're going to reach out to you um, right now they may just be focused with this queen of pinnacles here she's I mean if you look at her she's just kind of waiting for an opportunity I mean you can see she's just kind of focused on her coins and just kind of waiting around and waiting for an opportunity here and um, yeah, even though they feel rejected and they feel like you know this this is like a a misconnection they're they're going to try again so what is this going to lead to the lovers <laughs> so this is going to lead to a heart overhead decision we have gemini energy here so this is you know, this could possibly be a soulmate, possibly twin flame situation. To me, the lovers, when it pops up, is twin flame. And two of cups is soulmate. But all in all, this is Gem Gemini energy. And somebody's going to have to make a head over, or a heart overhead decision here. Okay? Whether you, you know... It could be you whether to take them back or not because I do see them coming in and trying to extend their cup of love to you again. Okay. Yeah. See, there's going to be communication here. Again, they're coming back in. They're going to be sending you some love messages. There will be communication here. Um, but we have the eight. Eight of Wands, so this is Fire Energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. A lot of back and forth, passionate communication, okay? And this is going to bring about this decision, this heart overhead decision in regards to this very strong connection that you have with this person, whether that is soulmate, twin flame, or what have you. But they <coughs> will be reaching out to you. I feel like they're waiting on the right opportunity to do so. They have felt rejected by you in the past, but um, they're coming back. They're not giving up on this. Um, they want some communication here, big time. Okay. All right. So let's pull some romance angels card for Sagittarius for their ex. What is going on with their ex? This is for Sagittarius. What is going on with their ex? Okay. Yep. Playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. And look at this. More communication. Heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. So they may come to you in, you know, like a young playful way it's a page you know it's not like the king or a knight it's a page so they may come towards you in a playful way to kind of entice you and offer you their cup of love like you know this this past crazy energy that we went through together you know maybe the time has come to revisit that they're going to try to keep it lighthearted, I feel and then they you know they just this conversation is going to be had, okay? Because this connection is so, so strong, all right? So that is what is going on with your ex. <laughs> they want to talk about, they feel rejected. Some kind of big dramatic ha situation went down and they've been waiting for an opportunity to talk to you. And they feel rejected and they feel like, you know, you're very focused on the past. But they're coming back in. They're not giving up. They're not giving up on this, okay? They want to talk. They want to talk. All right, Sagittarius, if you would like a private reading with me, all the information is down below in the description box. I will be going live Sunday through Thursday with live daily messages around noon Eastern Standard Time. And then I go live on Fridays with the Love Luster Loss. 
again around Eastern Standard Time. So if you guys want notifications in regards to that, make sure you hit that little bell, okay? Make sure you click the bell. Um, sometimes YouTube won't give out notifications anyway. <laughs> but anyhow, next week I'll be getting out the September monthly readings. Can you believe that? September already. I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. All right, you all, you take very good care of yourselves and have a beautiful week and God bless.